All right, so as everybody has requested, they want me to. Well, not everybody's requested it, but you get what I mean. Uh, I've gotten requests to play City of Heroes and kind of see a breakdown of it, so I figured once a week I might do about an hour of gameplay. We'll see. I haven't quite decided how long I want to play each character. Because there's no real good way of starting and stopping and whatnot, uh, since it's not on a match-to-match -match basis. It's just a straight RPG. So, log in. Um, go go to Everlasting. And we're going to create a new character. So we're obviously going to do Hero. We'll do Science. Uh, we're going to do a villain in City of Heroes Freedom. So. What do we got for melee damage? Not ranged. We're going to do Warshade. Let's see about that. What's a Corruptor? Okay, so that's a... That one's built more around uh, team play. Got it. It's a peace bringer. So, same with them. So... Question is, what do I want to play? I'll go ranged. Like I originally was going to. What's a defender? What's a sentinel? to, uh, I want to start from, we're going to do a Sentinel. I haven't done a Sentinel yet. So, question is, what do I want to run now? Dual pistols, and I get armor type. Go dark armor. We'll make our guy a little bit thinner on on, a, on the tall side. All right, so costume sets. 
make them those colors and unlink everything. Don't mind having him with a hat. Let's get closer. I suppose we should chain it. Change it. Kind of like that hat. Demon ears. I'll do skin color. We'll make his skin color a little bit on the darker side. Just take everything, all the details off for now. Chiseled face. Oh, that's bright on the eyes. <laughs> Sure, why not? make it well, let's just remove it Looks pretty good. Otherwise, I can always go with a darker color. Yeah, that looks better. Actually, kind of like that face. Uh, details.
And we'll go with the cigar. Go with the trench coat. Actually, we'll go with the jacket. Yeah, that looks okay. Sleeves. Make that all even looking. Chest got So we'll make it dark blue there. I'm not going to put anything on the shoulders.
that. Take off the belt. Because that doesn't shot through at all, does it? Nope. No, it doesn't. It doesn't clip through. Nice. Gloves. Body. Go with some slacks. Maybe. Yeah, we'll just go tuxedo pants. Oops. No tails, weapons, all right, so.
Perfect. That's a pretty good one, too. I'm not going to give him any back piece. That's cool. Let's make it during combat. Alright, that looks pretty good. Uh, maybe I'll change up the head a bit. The hat. That looks better.
All right, that looks good. All right, now we need a name for this guy. All right, so as you can see, I've taken about a half an hour just setting this guy up. Uh, I need to redo his freaking shit. I'm gonna make a magic based because since I'm using a ghostly aura, we're just gonna say his power come, his dark side comes in from his ability to commune with the dead. <laughs> I don't know what to call him, though. Kind of figured. as well. Okay. Um, fuck, I don't know. I guess, yeah, I'll go with the Zealot. Actually... in soul blood. We'll go with that. Let's see if that's available. Should be good. Yeah, we'll play the tutorial. We're gonna go break out. Because this is a villain. around I don't need power slide I never use it still dark embrace dark embrace can come back up over here activate that move that around all right I'm not sure what happened but there's some kind of big explosion that shook loose the bunch of the cells most of the cons made a break for it and ran into the yard only to be recaptured by security Lots of people are saying Arachnos is involved, and that they're trying to break out of some sort of uh, break out some sort of special people. Could even be you, I guess. If you want, make a break for it though. If you're gonna have to play it smart, I can hook you up with the right people to talk to. But I need a favor in return. Hmm. I haven't gone through this yet, so this will be interesting. I've got this pain, see? And the only thing that helps are the pain relievers they got locked up in the infirmary. Go there and persuade the nurse to give them to you. Yeah, sure, why not? So slow. What's up, Shaky Poo? You want what? Pain relievers? You psychos. Detonate explosives for drugs? Fine. Here's the key to the medical cabinet. Take whatever you want. Uh, you have found the pain relievers that he was asking for. Blah, 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 blah. 
Okay, I know you're dying to get out of here. Well, I got two guys you can see. If you want to make a direct break for it, then you can go see the Angel Lopez, but if you want to grab some of your equipment, then you should talk to Jimmy Dortz instead. I'll go to Jimmy Dortz, because gear is always good. It's him explaining things. What's up, my nigg? So you're the one called Veid and Soulblood, eh? Well, all sorts of guys and gals locked up here have powers, but some need gadgets to make their powers work. Just to make them work better. I can give you access to the lockers that hold all the devices. And after you go there and get something for me, I can help show you how to use them. Okay. Last week I had a buddy's shiv confiscated by one of the new guards here. As a favor to him, I told him I'd get it back. They locked it up in the gallery with him. All the other gadgets. That's annoying. Alright, where was I? Tell you what. You go get me that shiv, and in the process, you can get whatever devices your powers need to operate. This way, I'm in the clear, and you can make a big breakout a tad easier. Alright. Come back here once you have everything. So you've called... So you're the one... Uh, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. We already went over that. <laughs> What's up, guys? You recovered the shiv, you grab your gear, any blah blah blah. I didn't say that. You're a cunt. You said come back to you once you got it all. Oh well. Angel sent you, eh? Well, a lot of folks here are out. Out of practice when it comes to combat. That won't impress anybody even in Arachnos, so you better impress them. You plan to stick around for long. Sure, they think you're hot stuff now. That won't last if you can't show them some mad skills. First off, uh, okay, so that's just them explaining the health bar and sh all that junk. Alright, Blaze is downstairs. I see my pal Kay's showed you how to use your powers. That's good. Now I'll teach you about enhancements. Enhancements are additional powers that can make uh, additions to your powers that make them work be uh, at better effectiveness by enhancing a specific aspect of your power. Yeah, it's just the tutorial. I'm not going to bother reading that, just because... I... don't think that's where I was supposed to go yet. Why is it making me backtrack all the way back here? Okay, so it's not, it's just... have anything going on. Let me see if that Arachnos guy had something. Normally it sends you off to a guy, so... Okay, maybe I just need to get out now. Did I get any enhancements? I did. I got some power enhancements. Both of them into pistols. There we go. So now I got a power boost on those. Okay, he's here.
Two more, huh? Alright, it feels okay for right now. Let's talk to him again. Alright, I guess it's time to get out of here. Okay, light him up. pass on through because you don't really get much experience for killing these guys. What's up, buddy? Yeah, I like get to blow shit up. That's always fun. Instance combat. It's always everybody, and that's pretty much most of the game is doing missions and in instances. God, you're a fucking idiot, dude. right here. Almost didn't see that. <laughs> okay, yep, level two. Just hit exit. Him. I like that guy's name, Toxic Prick. <laughs> I'm surprised he got away with that name, not because it's, you know, inappropriate, but because of the fact that somebody hasn't taken it yet. Get our next ability. Alright. Tenebrous regeneration sustains your body, increasing your regeneration rate, in addition to protecting you from immobilization effects. This power always and on and can cost no endurance. I think I'll go with dual wield for now. Give me some more bullets to sling at people.
Veil and soul blood, yes. Interesting. It may, it may well be that you are one of the people we seek. In case you're wondering why you're out here and in the open air instead of enjoying the fine dining at Zagursky Prison, you have me to thank. I arranged it, you see. Some of your fellow prisoners are special. Perhaps even you. I have foreseen that some of your members of the group will rise up to usher in a bold new future for Arachnos. Of course, if you think that you're one of them, you'll have to prove it soon. First, though, I recommend that you present yourself to Arbiter Daz. He has marked on your map. The Arbiter oversees difficulties with Ara within Arachnos and helps to quell squabbles that might threaten the security of the organization. Remember, Arachnos is, the is beset by infighting among its many factions, but the Arbiters are above all that chaos. Despite all our d uh, divisiveness and squabbling, the Arbiters must never be harmed. Go to him and see if he can help you on your path. If you want to stay in the Rogue Islands, Vaid and Soulblood, there are, there's one thing you need to learn right away. Arachnos can be your ally or your enemy. Support us, serve us, and we will reward you. Stab us in the back, and it will be the last move you make. There's an operative here on Mercy who used to be our ally, but has recently made himself our enemy. Operative Burke. As we speak, the fool is planning to sell confidential Arachnos information to the troublesome do-gooders Longbow. I want you to take him out. You've heard of Longbow, I expect. A group of trained soldiers and their superhumans out to make everyone in the world do things their way. Their leader, Miss Liberty, seems to think that it's her place to meddle in Arachnos affairs. She's sorely, sorely mistaken, I assure you. Burke plans to meet Longbow at the docks. We'll have a flyer take you there. Okay, so... We now have our mission. Let's go uh, kill some people. It's been a long time since I've played through this area, so... Just hop in! You don't know Operative Burke from Adam, but you know bringing him in will make you look good to Kalinda. All right. Okay, so that's the edge of the level. Oh, I found him.
shoot his guts out. Get some gun fu going on here. Kung Fu. My favorite kind of Fu. <laughs> I've never used the dual pistols before, so I'm not as familiar with it, that's for sure. Linda, Kalinda, there you are. Birch has suffered justly for what he's tried to do to to Ghost Widow, but let me clue you in on something. Birch wasn't alone. He had orders. There are many factions within Arachnos, and they are always vying for dominance. Sometimes they even go so far as to betray Arachnos in order to spite each other. Captain Mako, Black Scorpion, and even Cicero. Ciceroco. All might have reasons for wanting to see Ghost Widow d hurt. Of all of, of all Arachnos operatives, only Arbiters are in, in Volet. In vi uh, Violet. Only they are never subject to petty squabbles that sometimes threaten to rip out great Arachno our great Arachnos apart. Yeah, I can't fucking read or talk today. Uh, it's 50 minutes for this video so far, so I can do one more. The biggest, nastiest snake in the immediate vicinity goes by the name of Sophus. Find him, defeat him, and you may find a future with an Arachnos as well. Okay. Now, I've got some things here. Rest on. Dual wield can get a range buff. It's over this way. I hope I have the right place.
Oh shit. Goddamn snake people. Shit, didn't see them. Cool. Gotta level up. That's always nice. Shit. <laughs> Turns out this was the right place. Is there anything else in here? No, no more guys? Okay. Didn't know if there was any extra guys lying in wait. So, I've got about enough time that I can turn this mission in, get the next one, and level up. Which sounds like a good place to stop for the day. At least for this video. I said, I don't know, I'll do one of these, one I'll play this character once a week for maybe about an hour. So that seems like a good, good run time. Um, maybe I'll make it twice a week once I start getting freed up a bit more. We'll see. But, oh. I haven't played a character like this yet, so even though it's something I have on my other server, it's different. So, you have faced the snakes and lived to tell the tale. Perhaps there is a place for you within Arachno's future. I must test you further. If you're doing well, I'd like to see more of what you're capable of. You may av avail yourself of my store's considerable resources. Please take the communicator and check in regularly. Are you aware of the lowly creatures known as the Infected? 
They've been subsisting off of the water from the cesspool trenches, and it's made them a bit of a problem. Many of them have gained enormous strength. In addition, they seem to have lost all sense of reason. There are a number of them massing in the warehouse nearby. Someone has to eliminate them, and I want that someone to be you. It'll give me an idea of whether you are worthy of future tests. So, okay, so I got a few things I gotta go through here. So we'll go into manage, uh, make dual wield even longer range, resist, I kind of figured dark, dark embrace would do that, defense buff, nope, I figures I didn't have any, and the other ones are endurance and a slow, I don't know if I have a slow, I will later, but. Yeah, let's see here. Nate, slow movement. Okay, so I do. Dual wield has it. So I'll just put them on pistol in that. And I'm just gonna sell off the rest. Because while I could put the in endurance reduction I'm not really chewing through endurance right now so at least not that I saw but yeah so that was City of Heroes and I hope you enjoyed until next time